Hey everyone, this is Corinne. Welcome to my channel, Corinne Cooks. Today I'm going to be making a dish called Crispetti di Porrucchini con Chova, which means anchovy stuffed leek fritters. So these are the ingredients for the leek fritters. We're just using the leek whites, which I already cut so that they would fit onto the cutting board. Um, but I just cut off the roots in the greens, of course. And the batter is actually going to have wild fennel seeds in it, which I managed to obtain instead of regular fennel seeds. And then yeast, flour, water, an egg, salt. And then we're going to fry it in some extra light olive oil. The first step is to cut the leeks in half lengthwise and then I'm going to rinse them off in a bowl of cold water just to get out any extra dirt that might be stuck in them. So now I'm washing the leeks in a bowl of cold water, doing it in batches so it's, it's a lot easier. Just swish it around like this. Probably gonna rinse them also. So now it's time to boil the leeks for 10 minutes. While the leeks are boiling, I'm gonna start the batter. So first you put in three tablespoons of water. And then I'm going to mix it with a teaspoon of the active dried yeast. <laughs> the yeast just exploded out of the packet everywhere. So I'm going to have to clean that up in a second. By the way, this is supposed to sit for 10 minutes. While the yeast is still foaming up, I'm just gonna beat the egg so that it's ready. The next step is to add the beaten egg, a cup of flour, and the remaining water to the yeast and water mixture. So that's gonna be 13, actually I'm gonna do the egg first. That's gonna be 13 tablespoons of water. So I'm just gonna measure all the tablespoons in off camera. So the next step is to whisk together all of these ingredients. And then once this is like a pretty homogeneous mixture, I'm gonna mix in the salt and the fennel seeds. Now it's time to whisk in the fennel and the salt. I mean the fennel seeds, of course. And now we just let this sit for 30 minutes before using it. So the recipe said to dry the leeks on a towel after boiling. They've been drying for a little bit now and they're still pretty wet, so I'm concerned that I overcooked them and this isn't gonna work out at all. But uh, luckily, as you can see, I boiled some other vegetables that I had laying around, so I'll still be making some sort of fritter. The recipe also said you could like fry any of the leftover anchovies in the batter or any random cheese you have, so we'll see what happens. So I'm going to tuck an anchovy into each piece of leek. Except I'm only going to do the four big... So, I'm sorry about that. The video cut off. But this is what the leeks look like stuffed with the anchovies. And now I'm going to dip them in the batter and fry them. This is the batter now. And the hot oil. So these are just some of the fritters I ended up making. I did eat a few. But these two are the anchovies. Here's the fennel. There's cheese, carrot, and then, of course, the leek fritters right here. I'm really excited to try them. 
They look so good. So I'm gonna try the leak fur first since that's what this video is about. So far it's like, it doesn't feel like it's gonna be crispy. But it looks amazing with this. No, this is so good. <laughs> the wild fennel seeds are a really strong fit flavor compa compared to um, regular fennel seeds. So, I don't know. For me, it's like the perfect amount of licorice flavor. I'm not getting a bite of the anchovy yet. It definitely is like a softer dough. It's not too like crispy. So I just started to get a taste of the anchovy and it adds like a nice salty flair to it, I guess. Also, the leek feels like it ended up kind of sweet, in a way. I don't know, it's really tasty. <laughs> I really love these, actually. Now I'm munching on the <clears throat> fritter I made with ricotta salata. This one's kind of dry. I'm not as much of a fan of this one. So this is the plain anchovy fritter. I don't know about this one. It kind of like like I think the anchovy kind of dissolved in the oil, so it's just a really salty piece of dough at this point. The anchovy stuffed leek fritters are definitely the best fritters out of all the ones I made. And that's including uh, fennel, carrot, ricotta, salata, and just the straight anchovy. Um, I hope you try this at home. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.